comes in. Jove is the world's leading producer and provider of science videos with a mission to improve scientific research and education. Plus, Jove's videos help teach science practicals effectively in the classroom, improving student engagement and increasing research reproducibility and productivity. Jove Research offers video demonstrations of novel and gold standard research methods, including the peer-reviewed Jove Journal in 13 disciplines, and Jove Encyclopedia of Experiments. It helps visualize details of experiments that are difficult to capture using text and saves time and money on travel and resources. Jove Education offers key theoretical concepts and methods explained visually, including Jove Science Education, Jove Core, and Jove Lab Manual with videos across multiple subject areas. With subtitles in seven plus languages, it helps improve STEM knowledge retention, leading to improved student engagement and learning outcomes. Jove content can be easily embedded into your LMS. And our playlists align with any subject, syllabus, or lab training. Whether you're a student, researcher, or educator, Jove provides the resources you need to stay on the cutting edge of science. Join the millions of people worldwide who are using Jove today. All right. Uh, very good morning to everyone joining this session. Uh, my name is Abigail D'Souza, and I am the curriculum specialist here at Jove. Uh, basically handling the UK and the Middle East and North Africa region. So very warm welcome and thank you so much everyone for joining us on this session. So what is it that we'll be doing today? And what is JOVE? JOVE stands for, the acronym stands for the Journal of Visualized Experiments. And your university, KFUPM, has subscribed, recently subscribed to all the JOVE video resources on the entire platform, which means faculty and students have access to everything under the Job umbrella. So once again, a very warm welcome. Joining me on this session is also Mr. Ahmed, who is the account manager for the MENA region. Uh, a big thank you to the KFUPM library and also Mr. Ali, who has helped us in uh, organizing this session and promoting this session. Thank you so much. Thank so you. Let's, let's get started. So what is JOVE? JOVE, like I said, the acronym stands for the Journal of Visualized Experiments. What we do is we provide video resources for education and research. So what it does is we have scientific videos that make teaching, learning, and practicing science more efficient, uh, engaging, and very effective. So bringing about more student engagement, helping them understand the concepts more in depth. So it's more like the case where we have a text where you're just reading from a text, and if you have a video. So say if you have a text, say, for example, you have a video, a recipe, and if you want to prepare, you want to cook something. So if you have a recipe, of course, the recipe is very important. The reading recipe is important for the ingredients. But if you have a video at hand, it helps us understand how to prepare the, uh, the dish more effectively. So similarly, that's where job comes into being wherein you, in, you have text and articles or textbooks which are important, but to understand the concepts in depth, your video comes into a picture here. And that's where videos help enhance student learn. A brief overview of Jove. Currently, we have around 18,000 plus videos in our library. And I'd like to say it's a growing library because we have around 1,200 videos that are published every year. We have 1,000 plus subscribers across the globe uh, with users across worldwide. All our videos are accessible 24 by 7. 
and they are available in 14 different languages in translations and voiceovers. There are around 10,000 plus protocols that can be downloaded as well for various research protocols. What do Jove uh, videos support? Like I said, it supports education, various training programs, as well as research. Now, how it uh, helps in education, training, and research, I'll show you by, in a bit. This is a Jove platform. It's broadly categorized into two different categories, research and education. Let's start with research. Uh, so Jove started off as a research journal. So like any other research journal that we have, Jove is also a research journal and it started off as a research journal. But just that, how is Jove different? It has accompanying each of our research articles. We have a video. So within research, we have the Jove video journal, which is actually our research journal. It's indexed in PubMed, Web of Science, SciFinder, Scopus, as well as SciExpanded. Uh, so various protocols, various text articles, everything is here within the Jove video journal. Uh, in addition, under research, we have the Jove Encyclopedia of Experiments. Basically, what this covers up is various biological techniques, various immunology, various rodent models, the various stages. All of that is covered up under the Encyclopedia of Experiments. Now, coming to our education collection. Education is broadly categorized into Jove Core, Science Education, the Jove Lab Manual, and the Textbook. And these are different in terms of the content they deliver, as well as the various level or various audience it caters to. Uh, while we browse and navigate through the platform, you'll understand these different collections even better. KFUPM has a subscription, so we call this the Jove Unlimited subscription, which means you have access to all the resources on the Jove platform. Uh, covering up Jove Core, like I said, so these are the various subject areas ranging from biology, anatomy and physiology, physics, uh, as well as engineering collections. Lab manual consisting of biology and chemistry, science education, wherein these these uh, comprises of real-time lab experiments covering a biology, engineering, environmental science, even psychology and clinical skills. And lastly is the Encyclopedia of Experiments and the 13 research journals. So this is uh, available to all faculty and students across the campus. And it's available at no additional cost given that the library has already subscribed it uh, for the university. How does one delve into Jove? There are three ways. One, of course, you can simply access it via your just typing in jove.com. What we'll do is I'll take you first through the website and then I will show you how to access it via your course page, via your library resource. But just if you're browsing through and you want to know what is Jove, all you have to do is go to Google or go to your uh, browser, just type in jove.com, j-o-v-e.com, and this is the home page. Uh, this is, so what I'll take you through is we have different tabs here, like you have the Jove Research, Education, Authors, Librarians, as well as you will see my name as Abigail Souza here. You'll have the search bar and everything. So this is how the Jove homepage looks like. Firstly, is the Jove Research. Like I said, it comprises of the Jove Journal and the Jove Encyclopedia of Experiments. You will find this under the Jove Research dropdown, including all the 13 uh, journal areas. Now, you can access it by clicking on each journal, but you can simply click on Jove Journal also. Let me click on the first thing, that's Jove Journal. And this is what this page looks like. 13 different disciplines, uh, with all the three, 13 different journal areas. And it's, in fact, I said, the world's first peer-reviewed video scientific journal. So it's indexed in PubMed, Web of Science. We have the most recent articles as well as the most popular articles written here as well. So if you want to browse to certain articles, you can do so just by going to the research and just uh, clicking on the 
various journal you would like to access. Second is the Job Encyclopedia of Experiments. This comprises of, basically covers up various methodologies. Biology, covering up various rodent models. Cancer research, covering up various biological research methods uh, utilized in various kinds of cancers. From even the, uh, uh, I mean, the neck cancer, uh, the nervous system cancer, all of that is covered up here. So prevention, uh, as well as the various stages, everything is under the cancer research. Um, we have the biological techniques area, covering our various techniques like PCR techniques, which we commonly known in the, during COVID, PCR techniques, assay techniques, uh, and the immunology collection. Now the encyclopedia of experiments, you have various, you have two kinds of videos covered up. One is a concept-based video, and second is an actual protocol performed. So this is a bit on the research. Coming to the Job Education. Let's start with the first. You, down, you go down to the Job Education and you click on Job Core. You have various collections accessible to you. Uh, what is, how is Core? What is Core? Every time you see the word Core, it would mean these are very animated videos. Very short videos ranging from one minute to three minute long videos. These cover up key terms and concepts uh, catering to the needs of undergraduate level students and even acts as a refresher for upper graduate levels. So if you do not want to go back to teach basic concepts, this is where this is more like a video textbook. Basic concepts just covered up in one to two minute long videos. And these are all animated. So that's Job Core. Second of the education is the Job Science Education. You have eight different collections. These comprises of animations as well as actual demonstrations of people performing in the lab. So real-time lab experiments. So that's what is covered up in the Job Science Education. These uh, are good for lab demonstrations, they are also good for upper level graduates. So more advanced uh, collection, I would say, as opposed to the Jove Core. Lastly, or second last is the Jove Lab Manual, as the name suggests. Lab Manual, laboratory, uh, journal kind of, wherein you have various laboratory techniques, various uh, uh, protocols, everything covered up here. Here, again, you have three different videos. One video in the lab manual, the first one is mainly for instructors. The second one caters to the needs of students wherein concepts are covered up. And third one is where the protocol is covered up. So actual demonstration in the lab. So instructor preparation video for the instructor, for the faculty, concept based covering up key terms and concepts and laboratory demonstration for the student wherein they can watch it and perform the experiment accordingly. So that is the third of the collection, Job Lab Man. And lastly is the Job Video Textbook. It's not very different from the rest of the collections. Mainly these videos are from our science education and mainly major chunk is from the Job Core. The science education uh, videos are just put as snippets. I'll show you in a bit. But basically, the videos are from Jovco. But how is this different? Currently, we just have the chemistry textbook. This is different from Jovco in the sense that this comes with in-depth text explanation. So in addition to the videos, you have a very uh, extensive layout of the text written with various quizzes, end of chapter exercises, everything that gets covered up here under the Job video textbook. And within education, all our education videos that you see here, all these subject areas, you can also access them via the subject areas, but all of these come with quiz bags. So in addition to all the videos that you see, each of our videos within this collection come with quizzes, which can again be inserted into your Blackboard. All videos can be inserted into Blackboard. All quizzes can be inserted into Blackboard. And students don't have to create a job account. 
they can access the videos within your Blackboard course page itself. So this is how the quiz looks like. You will have a video, you'll have questions. So certain videos have three questions, certain videos have five questions, but you can also add your own custom question. You can input your the quiz name, you can select a start date, end date, but even after all this setting is done, you can also edit the questions, edit the answers, and you can insert this into your Blackboard. And you can adjust the settings as per your Blackboard as well. So yes, um, now is how is Jove different uh, more than even the videos, more than the various collections? What is it that we offer? So in addition to all the videos that you have, access to via the library in addition to all the all the features on the platform that you have access to you also have access to the jobs faculty support team that is where i come in we have uh, people like me are available at your disposal so we are uh, around 40 odd members all from stem backgrounds and from the uh, we are working across the globe in fact and we are here to help faculty members. So in addition to these resources that you have, uh, we can help assist you in even searching through videos, uh, aligning them with your courses, and also helping faculty members even on one-on-one -on -one sessions uh, to insert these videos and design your course page. And this is all part of the library subscription. So everything available within your uh, subscription itself. How does this work? You can connect with me. That's the Jove CS, my cur the curriculum specialist. Uh, you can send maybe even your syllabus or even just topics. You can just share it with me. We will search through videos relevant to that topics and we will share it in the form of a playlist with you. You can view the playlist, see whether you find that the resources are relevant. If not, we can also edit it and share it back for reviewing. You can tell me, okay, I don't want this particular video. I want this one. We will create a playlist, share it with you. And then I can also help you insert or integrate this within your uh, Blackboard. That is within your learning management system. So we can do this. How would you connect with me? I will share my email address as well. You can connect with me on a one-on-one -on -one demo, which means we can finalize everything. I can help you set your page in, in within 10 to 15 minutes. Alternatively, we can offer even faculty-wide, even department-wide webinars. All of this is possible. All you have to do is get in touch with me. So yeah, like I said, we, we have dedicated faculty and library support. We do that through webinars. You can also send me an email. If you, can also, if you do not want to meet, you can simply share your query via email or even via call and we can have it solved. We can understand your course requirements, which means you can share your syllabus or your course details and we will fish or search for relevant resources and share it with you. So we lift the heavy burden. You do not have to search through 18,000 videos. We can do that for you and share it with you. Curate content, like I said, from our Joe's repository of educational videos, and also then help you insert these videos into your course speech. And if you encounter any issues, any help, we are here to help you. So just coming to again, what is your subscription? Everything under the umbrella, which means all Jove research videos, as well as all the Jove education videos are available for you and your students. Now coming to how do you access these resources? Of course, first I mentioned you can always just go to jove.com even when you're on campus, even while you're off campus. If you just want to browse through videos, you can do that. Uh, secondly is the Jove uh, IP recognition. So while you are on campus, it will recognize the uh, IP address and you'll be able to access it uh, just via through your library resources as well, or even just by typing in Jove. Thirdly 
is via the Jove LTI tool, the learning uh, teaching interoperability tool, uh, that 1.3, which is already installed into your Blackboard. Which means uh, you can access these videos through Blackboard as well. So you can access it even through your library resources from KFUPM library resources on your website, or IP recognition, or simply the job.com. While off campus, of course, through library resources, you can create a Jove account or you can just access it via the Jove LTI tool. Now, I'll just show you how, if you would like to create a Jove account and access it even while you're off campus or doing something else as well, you want to browse through the various features, various textbooks, I will also show you that this is what you got to do. This is the Jove homepage. You can, I can walk you. So even while you're on the call right now, if you all would like to create a Jove account, that will be great. You just have to type in www.jove.com on any of your browser. I can wait while we go through these steps. Yes, so once you have gone to this, or you just type Jove in Google as well, you'll be able to access it. Here on the top right-hand corner, you will see sign in. This is the home page. On the top right-hand corner, you will see sign in. Click on sign in. And here, most of you will probably not have a Jove account, but you all, if you already have a Jove account, you will simply enter your institutional email only and your password and sign in. But if you do not have a Jove account, all you have to do is click on create an account. Yeah. So once you have clicked on create an account, it will redirect you to this particular page. Here you will enter your institutional email address and click on create account. Following this, once you've entered your institutional email address, following this, you will receive an email. A verification email will be sent to your desired, your institutional email. And you will receive an email from Jove where you just have to verify your address. Yes, you'll get something like this. Thank you for creating your Jove account. Confirm email address. Just have to confirm email address or a link will be sent as well. Either of the two. And yes, just this last step, very quick step, a more in order to uh, recognize you as uh, the, the correct role, either professor or instructor, either librarian, most importantly. So you enter your first name, last name, password should consist of minimum eight characters ranging from uppercase, capital letters, small letters, uppercase, lowercase, a number, and a special character, a minimum of eight characters. Same thing in confirm password. Under institution, you need to enter the entire name. King Fahad University, Petroleum and Minerals. And then, then it will feature under the drop down once you start entering the name. And most importantly, like I said, select the correct role. If you're a faculty or an instructor or a laboratory technician, enter the role or a librarian, enter the role accordingly. If you're a teaching assistant, also please enter the role as a professor or instructor. So whether you're a Professor, associate professor is the same thing, professor or instructor. And you can enter your correct role here, like lecturer, teaching assistant, everything under the job title. And click on create account. Yes, so your account has been created. Now, uh, the only advantage of having to create an account is, of course, insertion of the videos, everything can be done via the Job LTI tool. But just to show you some bit of other resources that you can access at leisure. So this is the Job homepage. 
I'm signed in. This is where I showed you is the Joe research collection and this is where the education. I'll take you to the bit of how the videos are, like the Jove core, how does it look like? Yes, we have these new collections that have been added, which is the pharmacology collection, which was recently released. And we still have more videos that are getting added. So everything new that gets uh, that is uh, created or added gets is uh, added to the subscription. So anything updates, any new updates, everything is part will be accessible to you as well. For example, let me choose the biology collection. So here. Like I said, like a video textbook, you have various chapters. Say I want to, maybe the first, fourth chapter here, cell structure and function, for example. How does it look like? I just click on chapter four. Suppose I'm teaching this particular chapter. I can just go here. Very basic concepts covered up. So various topics. covered up in one to two minute long videos. So just showing you this example of the cell size. Some of the features that are standard throughout our education videos is a video. Cells come in a variety of shapes and sizes. Prokaryotic cells, such as bacteria, have a diameter of a few micrometers. While you so you have the speed regulation feature as well. You also have closed captions in 14 different languages. So everything accessible over here. So all closed captions available as well for the students. So even once you insert it into your Blackboard via the Jove LTI tool, all of this gets added, all these features. Little bit of text reading, just a snippet. You can share this video on social media, you can add to favorites, and you can create your own playlist. Which means, once you create your playlist here, you can insert these videos via the Job LTI tool within Blackboard also. To create a playlist, you simply have to click on Add to Playlist. Create a new playlist for the first time, the name will come, and you can just add it to a particular topic. Just check mark the box. So as you're browsing through the videos, this is possible for any video on the Joe platform. As you are browsing through the videos, you watch it, you find that this is relevant to the students. You simply have to go to create new playlist and just check mark the box. So you have the various languages also here. So whichever is, uh, if it's in gray, it's not uh, ready yet but it's in pipeline, but the others are all accessible. So the page also, the voiceover changes as well. Transcripts available as well. And you can insert this video from here also. So this is a bit on the Jove core collection. Likewise, I'll leave you to browse it. All the other collections are similar. Topics, various chapters within each chapter, many videos. Second of the Jove education is the Jove science education. You have various collections here. Let me just take engineering, for example. You have various uh, topics within engineering, ranging from mechanical, electrical, bioengineering, chemical, even materials engineering. These collections are shorter collections, which means in Jove Co, you have many videos as opposed to these. Because here what happens is you have actual demonstrations in the lab. So for example, I'll just take in stability of floating vessels. Features remain standard. You can navigate within the text as well over here. You can also navigate within the, uh, the video as well. Languages available, again, add to playlist, sharing on social media, as well as you can cite this article as well. So just to add to show you, performing the experiment part. Set up a water bath in an area shielded from air currents and place a solid white background behind it. Now procure a small, preferably white boat with a... 
So depending on which area, which topics, the demonstrations, of course, will vary. In biology, we have more extensive actual de lab demonstrations as well. So if you go to advanced biology, you have various neuroscience, cell biology, immunology collections covered up. Uh, within the basic biology, you have various laboratory techniques, lab animal research, lab safety, which can be used even in your uh, chemistry collections as well. You have chemistry, environmental science, and physics. And lastly, the Job lab manual. Before I go to the Job book, you have biology and chemistry. Let me just show chemistry. How is this different from that of uh, Job lab manual and science education? Is here each topic comes with three videos. Instructor preparation video. So if you want to add instructor prep, you will click on instructor preparation and add to playlist. You also have the concept, covering up basic concepts. And lastly, you have the student protocol. So this is how the lab manual is different from that of the uh, core as well as science education. Concept based is a con just the concept explained. Instructor prep will also have the materials list, everything listed here. And lastly, I said like the Job book videos are same, but we it offers in-depth text explanations. So it's coming from the Job core, but it has extensive text explanations. So each uh, topic you can navigate here from the various subtopics. Yes, you have the video and you have the text. You have also key relations and equations, key terms, end of chapter exercises. Most importantly, the Job book. Yes, so various topics which you can simply share with your students and ask them if they have understood the topic, they can just simply answer these and questions. So this is a bit on the Job education. Job research, like I said, is a Job journal. If I just go into one of these collections, it's like any other journal article, just that accompanying each of our journal articles is a video. So if I just go to a video, you can uh, sort it out to the publication date, author, and institution. You can sort it out for all articles because certain uh, videos are still in progress, or you can put as articles with videos. So even this, like you'll see uh, which the date of publication, uh, if you want to access the article page, so the list of authors, affiliated universities, related videos. But now if you want to access the article page, you will click on this hyperlink here. And it will redirect you to article, the word article here. And these can be downloaded in the form of PDF as well as material list. You can simply copy citation, download citation. You can navigate within the research article here. So this is a gist of the Jove uh, journal. Coming to lastly is the Jove Encyclopedia of Experiments. Just show you biological techniques. For example, PCR, given it was most commonly used during COVID. So each topic here comprises of a concept explained as well as the experiment, actual protocol in the lab. So you can simply access various biological techniques here. So this is our research, our collections. Uh, just to add is the faculty resource center. This has been one of the most uh, desired by many faculty members, wherein playlists are already created. So all you have to do is click on faculty resource center here. You have various playlists created on various topics. So if I just go to psychology as well, if I just want behavior and cognitive psychology. So all videos from Jove is listed here, be it from the education, be it from the journal. So you don't have to search through other, the entire platform, but you can simply go through various topics here directly. So this is where videos map to your courses and teaching labs. This is the way if you share your syllabus with me, we will have it mapped in the form of a playlist. We also have videos mapped to your textbooks. All textbooks. And you have various textbooks here. So you simply cell biology, microbiology, biochemistry, clinical, chemistry, physics as well. So just to show you physics, one of the Griffiths. So this is not the textbook, 
but jo videos align to the chapters within the textbooks if i just go to energy and oscillations you have videos related to energy and oscillations here so everything available at your disposal so any open education resources all of that are accessible to you now how can you insert this into your course management system first you simply have to go to your course page within blackboard so this is more or less you might it may not seem exactly the same but you might have something like build content and within build content you will have the jove lti 1.3 tool or just jove lti 1.3 depending on what it's named but you simply click on it if you want to add videos suppose you have created your own playlist already on the jove platform you can simply go to playlist so first you will have to create your playlist on jove and then you can access this or else if you just want to add videos you can simply go to videos you can search the topic here within the search bar or you can simply go to say clinical skills various physical examinations nursing so these are all the videos which are already there on the job platform so it's similar to that it's the same thing just here within your blackboard you can watch the video by clicking on this so open up in the full other screen and once you have done that you can simply keep adding videos and submit so they'll be all accessible here so these are the three videos that i just added they get embedded as three different pages if i just click on this yes you have the video at hand students will simply click on it and watch it they can watch it while they are on campus they can watch it while they are off campus the examination of the cranial nerves is essentially applied neuroanatomy and often the location of a lesion can be identified solely on the basis of physical findings there are 12 pairs of cranial nerves numbered rostral yes so thank you so much for your patience i know it's a lot of information to uh, gather in at once but if you have any questions i'm going to be dropping in my email address also please feel free to ask them now but i'll also be sharing my email address and you can simply get back to me we can also jump on a one on one i can help you also create various quizzes um and also showcase how you can insert an entire textbook into your course management system uh, any questions thank you so much for listening i have a question tell me uh how can you integrate these videos to blackboard is it possible to blackboard yes yes indeed uh so let me just reshow this so like uh so this for example uh, uh, your blackboard page can you see this blackboard can you see the blackboard page can can, can yeah, someone yeah. confirm okay perfect so you just go to your course page you have build content you'll probably have build content maybe somewhere else but you'll have something like build content and you will have the tool within build content listed as jove lti tool so it's already there in in your blackboard jove lti and here you see videos quizzes and playlist if you already have a playlist created you can simply click on playlist and you can choose the playlist so like now i already have a playlist created but if you are telling me to create a playlist for you like if you're sharing your syllabus you will i will be sharing the playlist with you and it will feature under shared with me for you so you can simply just browse through it from there as well but otherwise if you just want to create if you just want to add videos one at a time like for one course one video you'll simply click on videos go to the topic of your choice subject area 
AB the Geophysics Collection, Geophysics 2. Yes. And you can just add, just click on this add plus sign. That's it. So you're just going to you're just going to Blackboard. You're going to let me go back just to reiterate. You're going to your course page. First step. Second step, build content. Third step, click on the Jove LTI tool. And fourth step, you just click on videos of your choice. Here, you choose the sub. Now you can just go to various subject areas and simply click on add. So you just go, just keep clicking on whichever topic I would like. And I can just simply add. Just click on these add. Moment you see, you can also delete it. Suppose you do not want it to go into your Blackboard, you can simply delete it over here. But otherwise, you can simply just keep on adding. If you want to watch the videos from here, you'll just click on this. And you can watch the videos in another win window before adding it to your uh, playlist, before adding it to your Blackboard. And simply submit. All of this gets added towards the end of your course page. After that, you can always move it within your course page. So here you can make edit it. You can make it available, unavailable, everything within your control in Blackboard itself. Does that answered your question? Yeah, thank you so much. Perfect. Hello? Yes, tell me, sir. Uh, excuse me, ma'am. Uh... I'm yeah. librarian actually. Yeah. Okay. In the yes. mail library. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yes. Is it possible to any uh, get the statistics any by the subject wise statistics of usage? Is it possible? Who can access any? Uh, uh, any you will provide and if suppose we are asking to right. provide the uh, access actually the usage access okay. any Correct. percentage or subject wise. Is it possible to get that one? Yes, indeed. Uh, Ahmed can also. Uh, so, uh, Ahmed, can you probably just share the insight here? Yeah, actually, uh, uh, we will uh, ask uh, Mr. Ali if uh, which email that they need uh, to be as admin. So I can set up uh, the email uh, as an admin so you can uh, extract the, the usage report, uh, the usage uh, statistics, uh, even how much uh, spent uh, uh, by our time also. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Watch, the, watch the topics that uh, used, biology, chemistry, how much percentage uh, of uh, the usage also. So uh, just to provide me, uh, uh, or I will ask Mr. Ali uh, about uh, the email address, uh, which email that uh, the library needs to be as admin so i can register it in the our system here uh one more thing uh, actually uh, as a librarian how can any we help our researcher or faculties or users uh in any uh, uh in their research and you know just like searching or something is there any any techniques or any is there any some important things that as a librarian should know or yes. if someone facing issue in accessing the content uh, I yes. think there is no option in download, actually. I think you cannot download. Okay. Also, is there any tips, like, you know, as a librarian? We are, yes. So we Obviously. will use that tips to uh, any uh, retrieve exact uh, resource any for the user. Suppose someone is looking for uh, some yes. content. Perfect. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. So, Actually, Mr. P, she will be the main contact uh, for for uh, with you for this uh, uh, tips and uh, how to to help the people, uh, how to help the librarian, to help the the, the faculty members uh, inside the university, uh, provide them with the playlist, uh, integration with the Blackboard or uh, any LMS that the university have, uh, and uh, preparing uh, the course uh, list also. So please, Miss Happy. Yes, yes, yes. Sure, sure. If anything, yes. uh, we'll contact. Yes, indeed. But if you have to give it like right away, or if you just want topics, you can simply also use the search bar. I'll just uh, show you one. You just use PCR techniques. I'm just going to use PCR techniques. It gives you a list of all research related videos and mm -hmm. education videos. It also tells you which journal it is from. So if you know the faculty is probably from the neuroscience department, maybe this might be relevant. You can simply share these topics also. 
but okay. i would suggest is getting in touch with me we have our entire team so we have our entire team of subject matter experts specially separate for biology separate for uh, statistics separate for pharmacology wherein nice. they they will search they will create a playlist and will share so uh, uh, so if you have any syllabuses that you would like also even if faculty share them with you you can okay. share it with us and we will map it and share it back with you do you have advanced search system in this uh, job in search in research we do have wherein you can search through publication date that's currently that's the only ongoing thing but we will be upgrading this page wherein you can also uh, i'll show you exactly so like, like you know advanced search like suppose you are choosing some uh, uh, keyword and then then publication together and then yeah. you know uh, to specify more any rel to get relevant uh, literature or videos yeah so that will be only within our research when you go to the journal like if i go to research and oh, i okay, go okay. to journal the subject here right. you can go to publication date the author and institution okay so this is the advanced search system currently for for this Okay, thank you, ma'am. Uh, if anything, uh, anytime. we'll contact you. Okay, anytime, anytime. So if even any issue, any even issue. even if faculty want to meet like on one on one, understand, uh, I can understand post requirements and also help them integrate into Blackboard. If they want like the entire textbook, currently, within the LTI tool that I just showed, uh, it's not possible to integrate the textbooks, like the entire textbook in one go, but what faculty can do is they can tell me which book they are looking at. I will create playlist, share it into their account, and then it will be available in the, into their LTI under their my playlist. So I can help them that on one on one also. So any textbooks, any course requirements, uh, I'm here uh, to help you. So just one one query, ma'am. Uh, you're yes. talking about any textbook. Suppose yes. there is a new textbook just uh, just published. Okay. Okay. And uh, probably it is not in your uh, in the List. in the uh, any Correct. collection. Correct. So you will add the text. Sub, sub, you will add in your collection that book or with yes. videos and okay. explanation. Yes. So what can be done is you can share that textbook with us. So of okay. course it has. Uh, and then we will. It takes us. A, uh, so textbook mapping takes us more time. Typically, if you share syllabus, we have it delivered in a week's time. But if you want us to map a textbook like this, like for example, okay. if you give us okay. a textbook and you want us to create several playlists like this, it will take us approximately three weeks and then we can share it with you. Oh, great. Yes. So even textbook mapping is feasible. Yes. So this is like an example of our textbooks. Yeah. 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 Yes, sir. Uh, any questions? I'm also dropping in my email address. Thank so you. anytime you can always get in touch. Let me just... uh, all the, so the recording will also be available for faculty to access it. Just sharing my email address in the chat and you can access, you can get in touch with me at any time. In addition, I'm also sharing uh, this link to any feedback that you might have as well. Uh, you can always uh, share them your feedback. So this feedback always, it goes directly to the librarians as well. So, yes. So thank you so much for your time and any, any questions, anytime I'm here to help. Thank you so much.